Earthmaster is making a big entrance into the cutting edge vertical tillage market with Vertigo. A known innovator in heavy duty primary tillage equipment, Earthmaster strives to provide the most cutting edge technology to farmers. It's something they've been doing since 1949. As farming evolves, so does its equipment. To meet farmers' ever-changing needs, Vertigo is a natural extension of the revolutionary Earthmaster V-Ripper line. Designed for both spring seedbed preparation and fall residue management, Vertigo lets you take advantage of all vertical tillage has to offer. In the spring, Vertigo breaks through surface compaction with ease, so you can get the most moisture, nutrients, and air to the seedbed. Plus, Vertigo cleans up small weeds and mixes residue to prepare a smooth seedbed quickly. After harvest, Vertigo helps meet exacting fall residue management requirements. It easily chops through tough BT stalks, stubble, or straw. Then it covers the residue with just enough soil to assist in decomposition and minimize erosion. Vertigo's soil razor disc blades not only cut through tough stalks, they stay sharper with use, better than competitive discs for longer life. Greg Brucker started using Vertigo this spring to prepare corn and soybean seed beds. So far, he's been impressed with Vertigo and vertical tillage. We made a switch to vertical tillage doing a little experimentation, but we have seen we've had tr trash issues with the heaviness of corn stalks here the last four or five years. Even the bean stubble's getting a little tougher, hanging around a little more. Caused some issues with our field cultivator and our hero system. And uh, with the Vertigo, there's no problem with that. It flows through very nicely, sized up nicely, and a nice level seed bed. Michael Young has been using Vertigo on his corn crops for the past two years. Well, the Vertigo in the fall will speed up the decomposing of the, of the, of the residue. In other words, you, you get the stalks down on the ground and they, they will decompose a lot faster. And we're finding out with second year corn, that's what we need to do because it doesn't use up as much of the nitrogen early on as, as it would later. Vertical tillage works on all soil types and offers distinct advantages over other tillage methods. So how is vertical tillage different? Agronomist Bob Bailey explains. Well, vertical tillage compares to other tillage methods in that vertical tillage is not moving soil sideways as much as it is moving it upward and fluffing the soil. The other methods of tillage tend to uh, move soil sideways and tend to cause different kinds of compaction within the soil, where vertical tillage tends to eliminate those possibilities. In addition to eliminating surface compaction, vertical tillage helps dry out soil, gets rid of small weeds, and helps incorporate crop residue into the soil. Using vertical tillage in the spring has some advantages in that it fluffs the soil up, tends to lift the soil, uh, which will help dry out wet spots in the field. It also eliminates the early weed growth and it will incorporate the leftover residue that's on the soil surface with the added oxygen that's put into the soil. It helps decomposition to build more organic matter, more humus in the soil. The advantage of using vertical tillage in the fall of the year would be to uh, work the soil very shallow and to incorporate the residue so that we get good decomposition of that residue. It takes a lot of oxygen to get the uh, residue to decompose, and this would supply that because it fluffs the soil up. This spring, Greg Brucker found out Vertigo can chop up tough BT stalks with ease while minimizing erosion and leaving a uniform seed bed. Some of the issues we face in spring, um, as of late, all the trash, it's not decomposing like what used to, the stalk quality, et cetera. So, this did a real nice job because if sometimes our uh, field call bears a little trouble getting the trash through, that's not an issue with the vertigo. Came right through nice, sized up nice, just enough dirt to hold it from blowing around. But I still like to have a little trash on top and it worked out very well. To cut through tough corn stalks in the fall, Vertigo features soil razor disc blades. The cutting edge is on the side of the blade rather than the center. So as the blade wears, the cutting edge wears with it. 
the self-sharpening soil razor disc blades keep cutting through tough materials. The sawtooth profile of the blades also helps pin down crop residue so it doesn't blow away. This helps minimize erosion and keep nutrients in place when the residue breaks down. For Michael Young, the soil razor disc blades were one of the reasons he chose Vertigo. I like the frame design of the, of the tool. I like the rolling baskets on the tool. And the Vertigo also has their razor teeth blades, and I really like those. And, and I read several publications that said that was the blade to have. So far with the, our Vertigo, we ran over 1,500 acres, and I can see no difference in the blades than when they were new. They're, they're still very sharp, and they're still doing, the, doing a very good job. Greg Brucker likes the sharpness and durability soil razor disc blades bring to Vertigo. We like the soil razor disc blades that Vertigo has. Uh, they size up the crop very nice, they cut it, they just don't run over it it's like some blades would do and put a, just put a dent in it, they actually cut the crop up and they seem to wear very well, they seem to be very durable, uh, don't see any rock damage with them or things like that, they seem to hold up very well. The self-sharpening soil razor disc blades make blade maintenance a thing of the past. Getting the Vertigo field ready is almost as easy as maintaining the soil razor disc blades. After assembly, and before taking Vertigo to the field, the cylinders need to be phased to make sure they are working properly. Set the tongue cylinder so it is fully extended. Before going to the field, find a level section of concrete. Adjust the tongue cylinder turnbuckle to 47 and 3 quarters inches from bolt center to bolt center. Lower the unit to see if the front and rear disc gangs touch at the same time. If the front and rear discs do not touch at the same time, readjust the tongue cylinder turnbuckle. Raise the unit up and fold the wings down. Adjust the wing cylinders to level the wings with the center section. This is done by using the eye bolts. Any other adjustments are easily done in the field. When you have the vertigo in the field, set the tongue cylinder so it is fully extended. This is the position that the units should be run. Set the depth gauge in the middle of the depth box. Lower the disc and pull the vertigo through the field. Stop and note the depth of the blade in the ground. The recommended depth for running the implement is two inches. If more depth is required, turn the depth control counterclockwise. Every five turns equals one inch. We talked to Gary Anderson to see just how easy it was to set up the vertigo. It's very easy to set the vertigo. You got the center section, which you're uh, from front to back, and then your wing sections and side to side. And then when your depth control is what you need to change when you're going from field to field, the different uh, to corn stalks, the bean stubble, you need to control your depth because you're running three three inches at the most and one and a half inches at the shallowest point. Another important feature of the Vertigo is that it's built for trouble-free maintenance. The Vertigo is very easy to maintain with lubrication points easily accessible throughout the machine. Uh, all the bearings on this machine are the same bearings even for the disc gangs and the rolling baskets. And all this information can be found in your operator's manual. For easy access to directions for setting the machine, technical specs, and locations of the closest dealer or any other information you might need in the field. Vertigo has a QR code conveniently located under the cap in the operator's manual storage unit located on the implement. Simply take a photo of the QR code with your smartphone and it will take you to the Earthmaster mobile website or visit earthmastertillage.com slash product slash vertigo. If you're looking for a cutting-edge vertical tillage tool, you found it. Here's why Michael Young and Greg Brucker chose Vertigo. The reason I liked the Vertigo was the, the, the heaviness of the machine and the shark teeth blades. We chose the Vertigo tillage tool. We liked the way the frame was built. There's a lot of iron in that frame. It's well built. Uh, we liked a lot of tires on it. They're big tires for flotation, so it maintains its depth in uh, softer soils. Uh, it's got enough weight where it doesn't bounce to the field the speeds we were going. Made a nice level seed bed for us. Earthmaster's Vertigo will help you get the most out of your fields. Its soil razor disc blades provide the strength and durability you require for everything. 
From breaking through surface compaction in the spring to cutting through tough stalks after harvest, Vertigo has everything you're looking for. Learn more about Vertigo at earthmastertillage.com.